Hello everybody, welcome back to All The Mods 9. So last time we finished up on this nice little layout for the house. I'm actually really excited to get into it. I actually don't know how this is going to turn out. I have not thought ahead of just this layout, but I think it looks decent and we, we'll probably turn it into some type of tower of some sort. Maybe I'll make the roof kind of mimic what that is. Okay, so this time, we well last time we finished our backpack. And now that we've finished this, I kind of want to move forward on getting some resources because we have we have like nothing right now. I think that would be a good idea. I want to go ahead and oh, I can't repair. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, that makes sense at least um, that I can't repair that with cobble. We'll go ahead and make another crude repair kit, I suppose. I need logs. Hello? Do cinnamon logs work? They do. Nice. Just make a few of those. And we need one iron, which I put over here. Go ahead and make one of these. It is so cold in my apartment right now. I'm freezing. <laughs> uh, I'll probably put a few more iron in there just so I can repair it while I'm going. Because I plan to mine quite a bit um, while we're down there. Are you Okay, so you're, you're hoppered now. Which means I can toss this in here and you'll be good to go. Ugh. Oh, actually, since I have um, furnace hooked up and we have extra iron, I might as well... I think this is how you upgrade it, right? It is not. Ah, okay, you need glass. Got it. All right, so go ahead and hook that up, and we'll grab this other hopper here, and we'll just attach that to that. And we'll leave auto output on. Grab some coal, grab some copper, and we'll just chuck that in there to go while we are, while we go mine. Because right now, honestly, what we need the most are resources. Uh, look at that. Ooh, looks so nice over there. Okay. Let's go ahead and get to work. These are still clicking up. Right now we have uh, 57 dark oak, 16 spruce, 38 melons. 56 wheat. That'll be nice. I'll actually take the wheat and just craft us some bread for now. We'll move forward. So going forward, we will most likely work on getting some toast. There are a lot of foods in this mod pack. One of them being <clears throat> the avocado toast, which is massive for the amount of uh, satur or saturation it gives. There's better ones as well, but the avocado one is the one I went with last time. I might try to get this one, but then, then that means I have to set up all of this to grow. We'll see. We'll see what I decide. I haven't, I haven't, uh, wait, wait, buttered toast is worth more. Oh, it's because you need milk and everything. Oh, that's right. I can't repair this damn sword. Well, actually what I can do. Uh, I just want to get to mining, but I don't want to be without that sword. That's a really good sword to start with. Do I even have it? I don't even have enough iron, actually, to make an anvil. So we're going to have to go mine a little bit before we can even do that. For backpack, okay. Let's get down to the mines. Get some stuff done here. Also, I noticed this in post, that this was not aligned, and it really bothered me. Um, but, you know what, this, is, this needs a whole rework anyway. I need to make it look nicer. I don't have the builder's eye, sadly. Only five torches, but that's fine, we have sticks, actually. And before we continue that, I want to grab this coal here, and we'll make more torches. Even though torches have been making my life an absolute pain, especially with the lava... Oh, that's right. Back home we go. <laughs> I need the need the bucket. Closest source of water is over yonder. Yeah. 
iron already. Very nice. So many mobs, man. Okay, platinum. I'm gonna need this at some point. Oh, I can't even mine it. I need diamond. Okay. Wow, look at that cave. It is massive over there. More iron. Very nice. Oh goodness. Ouch. Just go over here and eat real quick. Oh, these skeletons are having it out. They're getting after each other. Kill the creeper. Kill the creeper. Don't shoot me, you bastard. Oh, you bitch. There you go. Hit him. Hit him again. Ouch. Okay. I am tired of this. Don't want to take more damage than I need to. Get dodged. Good lord, man. There's so many. Oh, here's the necromancer guy. Die. Oh, creeper behind me. Oh no, my sword. I should have been paying attention. Dang it. We've been ambushed, guys. <laughs> oh no. Oh, crap. Back up, back up the hole. Since our sword broke, let's go back up and craft another one. Now we did get some osmium, which is going to be really nice. I'll use that to start a metallurgic infuser so we can start stepping into mechanism. And I'll go ahead and check on our quests because we didn't check on them. We haven't checked on them in quite a while and I'm pretty sure we have quite a few already completed. After I go gather some resources, we'll actually step into some of the quest books so we can go about progressing in a way that is more tangible for you guys to see rather than just me mucking around and <laughs> just doing what comes to mind. Where do I not have an ore hammer? Oh, that's right. I broke the last one. Okay, well, I'll go ahead and make another. Get the iron going. Oh, we got a ton of osmium. I like that, though. I like to see that. Okay, go ahead. Smelt up. Uh, we need another hammer. Now, we'll crush up the rest of this osmium. We'll crush up the lead and we'll crush up more copper. We're going to run out of the ore hammer again. That is fine. We'll toss the copper in there. We will toss more osmium. Oh, again, we got quite a bit of osmium, actually. Oh, there's a level two. Ooh, I might try to get that guy. But if we do, I'm going to have to cheese the crap out of it. I don't know if I'll be able to get him normally. We have this broke ass bow. What is this one? Ender. Okay, I'll save that. This is from that Iron Spells and Spellbooks mod. It's pretty cool. I definitely plan to check it out. I don't typically do too much magic, but I feel like that could be something that is uh, fun for me to try. Maybe that could be good. That could be good, I think. Um, can I turn... So if I make osmium boots, I'll just I'll just wear these for now. Screw it. I was trying to turn them into silent gear, but I guess I need to craft it. Where's that blue boss at? Oh, and before we continue, I forgot to set the difficulty hard. Okay. Um, I remember setting it to normal, but I typically play on hard, especially in large mod packs like this, because it, if you're playing on normal, it could be too easy. I don't, I don't want it to be too easy. 
Now where is that boss? I don't see the blue boy anymore. There's a green one. There's a zombie with a ton of armor on though. Got compressed iron and one of them's enchanted. Now if I throw this, will it come back to me? It will not. But it does more damage, I think. Did you drop any of your armor? You did not. That's unfortunate. Oh, you need, I believe you need an enchantment for it to come back to you after you throw it. I thought if you hit something though, it came back. Oh well. Are these bosses despawning on me? Oh my goodness. Okay, never mind. <laughs> There's a lot of mobs over there, man. Nice. Used one of your buddy's bows against you, bud. Goodness. Is that a... That's another archer. Do I have many arrows? I should have some arrows. Oh, a better bow as well. When it's not about to die. No arrows. Oh, I missed. Oh, here we go. Oh, you have a Paxel or something? Okay, well, we're just getting attacked over and over, so I'm just gonna... Oh, I can't. Oh, that's why the mobs are all over the place. That would make sense. Okay, well, let's just, uh... Light up our house, shall we? I think I'll also... Scared me again, buddy. We'll move this indoors. We'll just put it right here. Respawn point set. Oh, you bastard. Oh, you bastard. Come this way, then. Since you want to be a punk. Oh, shit. You mother... Oh, that's right. I claimed the area, so it's fine. Hey, chickens. How you guys doing? Baby chicken! What's up, cows? Thank you for your service. Whoa. Oh, you dropped me a shovel. Blue shovel, too. Nice. It has iron effectiveness against all blocks. Would you look at that? You bet its attack sucks. Still, that's a blue tool. It's nice. Oh, I need to, uh, I need to turn the music off. Just because, you know, when you do cuts and everything, the music kind of gets all in the way. Oh, I see you. What the hell? What the hell? Did it bug out? Where's Kevin? Oh gosh. Kevin has spawned, guys. We're screwed. <gasps> I missed. Damn it, Kevin. Ah! Little Timmy! He dropped a backpack. Oh, f he sees me. Um. Oh, he's kind of dumb, though. Oh, shit. Those are cave spiders. 
That's a cave spider spawner. Kevin's being stupid. I'm not even safe in my house because of those cave spiders. Ouch, oof, ouch, oof. Okay, this is a green helmet. What do I have on him? Okay, this is more armor and max health. I'm gonna wear this for now. Okay, I'm gonna wait for the damn sun to come up to kill all of you, and then I'm gonna go murder Kevin. Devath the nifty as well. Thank you. You gotta move some of the coal out of there so I can smelt things, actually. Okay, Kevin. It's time for our bout. Oh god. Bad idea. Come on, Kevin, you're smart. Yeah. Okay, Kevin, come on. Hey, bud. Sorry, but I'm gonna cheese the shit out of you. Blue pants. Oh, nice. Projectile protection 5 and luck 0.5. Okay, so we have extra luck. Well, isn't that something? Well, we have new pants. We got blue, we got blue pants. That's nice, at least. Got something out of that entire ordeal. Hey, okay, the iron's cooking up. Well, we lost our... Sadly, we lost our uh, blue sword, but that's okay. I don't want to lose the trident. What I might go ahead and do is... While we're waiting on more ore to be smelted, we'll go in here. So, bouncy board. Got a common reward. Oak drawer. Actually, let's see, can I just... There we go. Bunch of stuff. Now. Ah, okay. Oh, I got a mob yoinker. That's gonna be nice for later. Oh, a wolf spawn, a wolf spawn egg. Gold sights and another drawer. Okay, well, we've got a ton of stuff and things. Oh, scrambled eggs. Steak. As you see, we don't have much space, but I will proudly show this off right here. Boom. This is, <laughs> this is what you get for killing the wandering trader. <laughs> I will do some mining, some more mining now, because that is ultimately what what we need at the moment. I'm going to make a, another couple ore hammers actually here. So I can just brush. Oops. So I can have one ready when we come back. Toss the copper dust into there. We have lead. I'll toss the lead into there. All right. Well, we have quite a bit of osmium now, which is very nice. Put the ore hammers in there too. And we'll go ahead and skedaddle. Oh, nice. Got the hearty meal achievement. I didn't even have to craft it. It was crafted for me. We need to make another, uh, another staircase thing. Okay, now we can climb up here and grab the water and then finish off the staircase. Take that with us. Okay. Oh, we have another tunnel. Nice. Now we can continue mining away. I do enjoy seeing that. That will be useful. We are getting to where this pickaxe feels slow. To the deep sleet. Hello. Oh. Not a mimic either. Oh shit. You 
poor guy. You've been screwed over. You know what, though? I will assist you with this. Consider it an act of kindness. What do you have in here? Just stuff and things. Okay. What a nice, what a nice zombie you are. What'd you drop? Blue pants. I just got blue pants, man. Don't want them. Cole. Are you being smart? Oh shit. Where's your spawner? Oh, it was the thingy that spawns a bunch of them and then they go away. Okay. Oh, goodness, we found one of these chests. <laughs> All right. Well, since we have our lovely backpack here, we can just toss most of it away and check what's in here again. Okay. Some string, nice. Some horse armors, which I'm not too worried about right now. We don't have a salvager yet. We can't break those down into raw. It prevents me from dying from one of these by a 50% chance. Okay. The rope I can make a lead with. Tablet of, tablet of detection. Wild and spike. Yeah, these are used in Ars Nouveau or R Nouveau uh, recipes. Oriel bottle. Compressed stone. Pneumatic craft. I might need that at some point. And I'll take the dark steel because I do plan on making uh, some... Ender I.O. crafters, maybe. Early on. Tablet of home. Interesting. Ooh, some blue boots. The ender. That gets you extra mob heads, if I remember. Tablet of cupidity. Oh, this one teleports you to a spawner, if I'm remembering correctly. Gold site 4. Another gold site. Interesting. These are pretty nice. Tablet of conjure island. Okay. And these are these are quite neat. I'll take the blood, maybe I'll mess with it later. Uh purification, just in case, and we'll take a saddle. Sure. I'll take all that junk. Who knows? We might need that later. Go ahead and break that. Oh, look at this. Oh man, I almost uh died. There's a lot of redstone down there, but I'm not gonna go for it. I will take this anvil though. It'd be really nice to have. And what we could do with that anvil, um, it doesn't make it unbreakable, but it's nice at least to have one. An anvil on a stick. Low iron. Is this prosperity? Yeah. We need that. We're gonna need some prosperity to start getting into mystical agriculture. More iron. There's some tin. Gold. Very nice. We do need gold right now. Well, that was nice. Nice little nice little detour over there. Let's continue. Oh, let's continue mining down. Oh, some Okay, it's forcing me to get some tin <laughs> since I've been avoiding it. Oh man. You see, our luck has been insane with these caves. <laughs> Alright, since we're at another cave, I'm gonna do a slash home here. We will take a nap and we'll get everything sorted. I know I got a a few drawers from those quests. I think since we did get a bit while we were mining, I'm going to go ahead and try to do a small amount of organizing because, yeah, things are all over the place at the moment and it's getting more and more difficult um, to deal with. So I think I'm going to go ahead and move stuff over, get some things smelted, and I will see you guys after I move everything. Or unless something else comes up. I actually will upgrade my backpack to a gold backpack before everything else. Just so I can have that, just in case I do run out of space. Okay, let's get to moving things.
boom we are reorganized let's go baby i've essentially tried to categorize everything i'm just putting smelted ingots and things we mine in here for now i have this set up here with tiny coal going into these furnaces and their input output is on the bottom now the input output could cause issues if we were to cook something like coal in here right now but at the moment this is a fine setup until we progress further on this is for any gear that we might get these are for apotheosis crystals and such mob drops anything related in that category as well we have foods and seeds in all of these and any bee um, or forestry type items these are our random uncategorized for now this will be like stone types this is uh dirt gravel types and this is wood then we have any raw materials here and anything related to processing over here i am so happy with this this is gonna make my life so much easier okay all right now that we are good to go in this department i'm gonna grab a thing of cobble and i'm actually gonna go ahead and move our waystone to this front area here this is where i would like to have it home oh, very nice oh man so exciting okay 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 oh that's a big ass jungle tree or a dark oak tree i want to take this down i don't want this to be sitting here oh man we just got a ton of stuff in our inventory whatever will we do i'm glad you asked just boop oh my goodness that is insane well, we're organized. Oh my gosh. Let's take three of these and fill that up. Okay. Now, before we go, I want to take a look at some silent gear. Actually, if I do, if I put, I think I can put a diamond tip on this. I don't exactly remember how to do that. Hmm. Well, let me check my quests, get some more stuff. Oh. I was just about to go get an infinite water source. Beautiful. I'm so happy to see this. Sink, you are a lifesaver. The sink, if you've never used it, this is an infinite um, water source. You can pipe out from it and you will get infinite water. It is an amazing, amazing, amazing item. Ah, uh, okay. I need to do a tip upgrade. I'm going to have to look into this stuff, man. I'm going to have to really, really go looking into that but for now i think i'm gonna go to go to sleep and then i'll go mine a bit because i do believe i need lapis and redstone at the moment Ooh, i slept right before the blood moon rose that's a nice that was nice timing for me okay so like i said i'm gonna go mine i need some redstone and i need some lapis so i can actually start moving forward with some gear so let's get to it into the mines the children yearn for the mines. Holy shit! They got the whole squad, man. Do we just go for it? Oh shit! Hey, f you. I'm so used to that good sword. Uh, uh. We're a damn pincushion right now, man. Oh, easy peasy. Not even close, dude. That's Jesus Christ, bro. They fucked me up, man. Yeah, negative one is the ideal range for lapis, but that's not all we need. We actually need redstone as well. So I will continue down. Oh gosh, that's right. We need to do this again. Holy moly, is that Greg Tech? That's Greg Tech redstone, isn't it? Yeah, there's no. Oh shit, zombie brute. You, you. Oh my God. Die. What the hell? <laughs> I can hit him. Get out of here. You stink. That was rough, man. Shit. Petrified lichen. Oh, look at this deep slate redstone. 
This is gonna be insane. Oh yeah, look at all that. Oh man, we can smelt all that up. So this part of Greg Tech is really nice. <laughs> but uh, yeah, just this part though, just this part. Oh my goodness, look at all this redstone. This is beautiful. Ow, bitch. Where's that steak? Yeah, we'll eat this. Hopefully I'll get two hearts. Oh yeah, I called it, baby. Two hearts. Oh shit, you got the whole squad. Get off of me. I would like to just go mining, please. Thank you. Oh hell. Oh, I got... What the hell, did you spawn right behind me? Oh, he just blew up. He blowed up. Good lord. Okay, what's in here? Ooh, slime spawn egg. That is gonna be so nice. Oh my god, we can already make a slime spawner. Well, first we have to get the dragon egg. Um, so, apotheosis allows you to modify spawners. If you get the ender dragon egg... Oh goodness, leave me alone. It allows you to remove conditions from spawners. Sure, I could leave the spawner that I create in a slime biome, but I would like to avoid having to do that, and I could just build it nearby um, if I put the ender dragon egg onto that spawner. Am I out of torches now? Nice. What the hell? Oh shit, what is that? Oh, it's the necromancer, you son of a bitch. We're leaving. On your feet, soldier. Okay, so from... I can't even mind that, so we'll just go this way. Large tunnel. Oh. Let's just mine out this way. Since I have no torches... Um, I'm just looking for, like, one lapis, please. Can I please get a lapis? Can I please get a lapis? Bort. Can't recall what Bort's used for. Just just one lapis. Just one. Uno. Uno lapis, por favor. No lapis for me, I suppose. Well, we didn't find any damn lapis, which is very, very, very unfortunate. Um, but right now, I'm not even looking for it for... The purpose of using lapis itself. I'm looking for it for dye. And I could just avoid dye. Um, by making a hopper botany pot. And putting the corn flour in there. I think I have a corn flour, right? Somewhere. Yeah, I think I can turn this into blue dye. Yeah, okay. So I'll put this in a hopper botany pot. And... Uh, yeah, we'll get going with that. Oh. That is not what I needed. Um, <laughs> okay. Well, I did that. I just did that. Need those. And just take this chest right here. This. Make a hopper. And then hopper botany pot. Oh, it's... That's why, because I need bricks, damn it. I need bricks, not terracotta. I'm a silly gooba. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom, boom. Upper body pot engaged. Very nice. Okay, so place that next to that, and we'll get a drawer. Over here, place that. All right, let's go get the... Let's go get some Inferium, just one, and need a dirt, and where is my hoe? Boom, boom. Do, 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 do. Okay. Oh, the Blood Moon again. Uh, that's unfortunate. 
Oh, that's the worst feeling in Minecraft, isn't it? When you strip a wall in your base. Oh, that hurts. It hurts every time. It hurts every single time. Ugh, go away. Well, I can't sleep because of the blood moon. So what can I do? Well, I have a ton of redstone ore. So why don't we just uh, go ahead and toss some in here? Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah. Oh, look at all the redstone. It's so good. Look at all of it. Just, just look at it. Just look at it, guys. Just look at it. It's so amazing. I'm so happy with that. Well, it would be nice to get some early power going. Okay, let me go ahead and I'm going to dig this out real quick. Give me some room over here. Hey, hey you. Oh my God, I'm missing everything right now. Nope. Ouch. You come into my home and you shoot at me. Piece of shit. You piece of shit. Don't do that. Oh, hell. I need more dirt. Oh my goodness. And I need to put some stuff away. I knew it. I heard you. Oh, shit. Good lord, man. The... The blood moon is rough. There's so many mobs. Can you guys fuck off? Holy crap. Dude, I swear they just spawned them right behind you now. They have to be. Yeah, because you just know I'm over here, huh? off Jerry oh I broke my little I think those were my gloves right yeah I just put on the second pair as well but yep the second pair broke just now that was a redstone yeah that's how the redstone is it's delicious okay dokie oh shit oh that actually scared the hell out of me <laughs> I forgot in hard mode they can break down doors. Oh my god. Oh, it scared the stretch out of me, man. Shit. Hey, you. You're supposed to be burning. Yeah, there you go. Thanks for listening. Okay. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do now? Oh, I got a fluid pipe? Oh, boy. I'm just going to place that there. Okay, so let's get into early power, shall we? Let's check the, let's check getting started. See if it has any power. It does, it has starter power. What does it want us to do? We will follow this, okay? Ah, I see. There's a coal generator. There's an augment generator for a furnace. Okay, well, let's go ahead and uh, we'll mess with that, shall we? We'll mess with that power. We'll get some... We'll get some early power with that. So, augment generator. Go ahead and favorite that. What do we need? We need redstone, a redstone repeater, which I think we can make because we have the sticks, right? Oh, we need stone, which we have some stone. 
um, make the repeater here. Need some kind of other stone. I don't think we need tough, but I'll use it because I don't plan on using tough in anything anyway. So, all right, we have the augment generator. Now, let us take this standard furnace here. Um, grab some iron, grab some gold. We need some glass as well. So we can upgrade this bad boy to an iron furnace and then to Ooh, gold furnace takes a block of gold. That's okay. It'll be more power efficient if we do it this way. Now we have the gold furnace. I have the check mark here, but I oh I don't have the check mark. I have to build. Well, I want the quest reward, so I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. Build iron pick. There we go. It's because earlier I didn't put the iron pickaxe in my inventory. Oh, we got some iron sight as a potion. That's an apt reward. Another, we got a gold ingot and a magnet. Nice. You can pick up XP and how do we activate it? Right click, okay. And I can put this in a charm slot. Nice, all right, so it'll pick up items from five blocks away now, sweet. What cables do we want for early power? That's the question actually here. Oh, look at that. Oh, another lava bucket, that'll be nice. Okay, so early power. Let's just uh, put this in the ground here. I want to see. This produces 40k, 40k, netherite, Jesus, 40k, 500k, 40k for lapis. Ooh, redstone is 10k, actually. We have a ton of redstone. So we might just tap into that real quick, actually. Since we have redstone now, if you remember what I was trying to do in the first and second episode, I was trying to make item pipes. So let's go ahead and do that. Item pipes, yes. Oh, yes. Have my wrench on me? I do. Sweet. Okay. So, what we will do now from here is I'm going to create a barrel. Actually, no, I'll use a drawer. I'll use a drawer here. We don't want the one by two drawer. We want the one by one. Okay. Sweet. We'll place the augment on. So, you can right, right click it, or if you don't want to right click it, you click up here for augments. It's, yeah, it's pretty nice. So we'll do auto input and we will we'll input from the back. Actually don't need the item pipes right now, but place that there and we will, can I not? I thought I could, uh, why can't I, <laughs> why can't I store into the drawer? Do I need to be on a face to store on it? Oh, I suppose I do, huh? Okay, well, let's just go ahead and put the dust in there. Oh, it, it can already store up to 10k? You're not working, are you? You're not letting yourself get pulled out of. That is weird. Why not? I am confused. It says it takes redstone, right? It does not take redstone. What? The augment said it did. Blasting? Oh, I need the blasting upgrade on it. Oh. I'm a silly goober. Okay, that makes sense. Let's go ahead and just nab this again then. I see, I see. Um, okay, so we can do what I wanted to do. Just place this down here and we'll have this uh, Pipe, just pipe out power and we'll just pipe it along the ground here and I will actually use a pipe um, just for my peace of mind and so I can see the drawer like that so when you're using the pipes mod 
you if you have if you have a pipe place like this, it's not gonna do anything. You need to make sure that you right if you crouch right click or shift right click, whichever one it is. I use control. Um, you want to make sure it's flaring out like that. This means output whatever is in the machine or block wherever this uh, flaring out is happening. You can also go into it and you can add upgrades here, which in here it would increase the speed based on whatever type of pipe it is. Uh, this would be eight items per 15 ticks. I think right now it's four items per 20 ticks. Um, so that's four items per, per second right now. Uh, 20 ticks is one second in Minecraft. Okay, we need a blasting augment. Okay, we have the iron on us. Let's, oh, we need to make a furnace. Okay. Take the blasting furnace and grab the tough just because screw tough. Oh, we need more paper for the upgrade. Blasting furnace, boom, okay. Now we have the blasting and the generator augment. So now if we do this, plop, plop. Yeah, there we go, look at that. The RF is kicking. That's what I like to see. Okay. Early power has been achieved. So these are power cables here. Which one do I wanna go with? I usually go for universal cables, um, but this requires steel. This one's much cheaper to start with, so I might just do the energy pipes. I actually rarely use the pipes mod aside from their item and fluid pipes and such, just because they are a bit easier to manage, I feel like, in certain scenarios. So I'm gonna go ahead and we have the iron on us. Let's grab some more redstone. Oh, that's right, it's a whole block like this. Let's go ahead and make some energy pipes from the pipes mod. Okay. There's our quest done, yeah. Now I will prepare the ground for my assaults. Just gonna be this. So, and then we'll just boop, 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 boop. Um, I think you still need to do this for the energy to go. So it's prepared to go out. Okay. Go back to getting started here. We've got this reward, which, ooh, copper upgrade. That's gonna be nice. So what we can actually do is if we toss this in here, we can just toss a shit ton of redstone in there. But I think I'll use that over here for one of these um, to keep going. Just toss it in here for now. Those aren't going to grow too fast for for the moment, but later on it'll be really nice. I'll uh, once we get some higher higher level farmland and we start getting some diamonds and such, then we can work on that. Yeah, that's right, we have that one iron pick. Oh, we still have a few things in here that I need to clear out before we go back mining. But anyway, let's check out basic power here. Ah, okay, this is talking about all of these mods here. Let's just go ahead and complete this. Complete that. Heat generator, coal generator, and the renewable energy. Okay, so these are, these are other ways to make... Um, uh, power. Whenever I do power storage, I typically use um, mechanism. Well, look at this. More free stuff. Upgrading our pipes. I need to make a pipe upgrade. What was that? Was that osmium? Iron. Iron nuggets. Okay. I'll go ahead. Yeah, I'll go ahead and make a basic pipe upgrade because that will give us. Uh, That will give us a reward if we make one, right? Yeah. Quest line, baby. One to three of those. How many did we get, I wonder? Oh, we got the max. Very nice. Okay, sweet. Which means 
we can install that on both of these. So now it'll output power a bit faster. Okay, dokie. Let's look into the starts of not Greg Tech, but I do want to look at the quests that are being offered here. What is this? Oh, it's just explaining what things are. Okay, well, I don't want to get into Greg Tech right now. I don't know enough about it to even start with it. But let us look at Mechanism, because boy, do I know this mod. Let's go ahead. Since we, we already have power, I know we already have power, but... Um, let's go ahead and make the heat generator, just, just because. Just so we can get through the quest line for Mechanism. And we need the beautiful metallurgic infuser. Two more furnaces. I need more cobblestone. The metallurgic infuser is literally the machine that you need with mechanism. It's how you get uh, through all of the <laughs> early game stuff. Now, um, for mechanism, you need a lot of redstone, a lot of iron, and you're going to need a lot of osmium. Oh, look, we already unlocked this. So we get... We got an Osmium ingot. Nice. We didn't even get any cool things. So from here, this allows you to create infused alloys. Infused alloys are redstone in the fuel slot here, and then iron, and then with power, it'll cook into an infused alloy. And the basic control circuits are uh, redstone, redstone here, and Osmium. And it takes two redstone per one osmium to get one basic control circuit. Then it just continues up this line like this. So you combine, you combine the basic control circuits with the infused alloy to get the advanced control circuit. Then you make reinforced alloys and you combine those with advanced control circuits to get the elite control circuit and so on. So let's look at the enrichment chamber here. We need steel casings and to get steel, you need to cook up steel dust, which steel dust you get from combining iron dust with coal. The only problem we actually have right now is that we don't have much iron left. But that's just how it goes when you're messing with uh <laughs> when you're messing with stuff early game. Let's go ahead and make an ore hammer here. We need one. Now let's go ahead and how much do I have steel? I have one steel ingot. Okay. How much do I need for the enrichment chamber? I think I need four. Yeah, four. Okay, so we have one, which means we need three dust. Where's my ore hammer? There it is. So three dust. Boom. And do that. And ore hammer, steel dust. Then we plop the steel dust in there. We let that bad boy cook. Then we grab our steel dust. Oh, nice. We had some iron in there. And then we go to the enrichment chamber. We see you what it needs. We need glass, take the glass, make the enrichment chamber steel casing, and we need basic control circuits, which require the osmium and redstone. So what we do is we take one, two, three, four, one, two, and this bad boy cooks. <laughs> Tricking a rock into thinking. I did not know that was a achievement. That's cool. But now we can make our metallurgic infuser. It's not as good as the ore hammer, but it is it is something that's automated. Uh, for early game, you get uh, so if you put in three, you get four. So you get you put in three and you gain one more. So you get about thirty three percent more uh, than you normally would. But with the ore hammer, you get one hundred percent more. So it's better. You're better off to use the ore hammer. So you just wait until you get to this step over here, which would be you setting up your tier two ore factory, which is uh, pretty good. And that turns, as you see here, turns three raw ore into eight ore shards. And the ore shards are then turned into um, some other form. I can't remember. I think it's ore chunks or whatever. Then they're turned into ore dust, and then they are smelted. It's a whole process. It takes like six, seven machines, but we are not there yet, so we will not worry about that. Now, the enrichment chamber is used for more than just crushing dust. 
Um, as you see, there's 68 pages, and there's not 68 or to use. Actually, there might be with Greg Tech being in the in the pack, but it is used for other things as well. So it's useful to have. I think I saw. Yeah. So here you can turn gunpowder into flint just with using power. It's very nice. I'm just gonna go ahead and plop that down right there. Making those two basic circuits actually took seven redstone. That's crazy. That is not efficient at all. Um, what we're probably going to want to do is move this backwards and put a power cube here so we can have multiple power sources going into this thing. Um, because then we can build the heat generator and connect it up as well. Put that on top there. Nice, okay. Nice little thing. We'll place that there. <clears throat> so, heat generator. Place this here. Place that there. Go grab our lava buckets. Um, before we do that, we'll grab the energy cable here. And we need to move this as well. Okay, now it can output out the front. Output, auto output. Um, okay. And then we'll go ahead and break this. Oh, that's right. These things just keep what they have in them. That is so nice. Auto input. And then we will have the fuel input here. Um, you have your blasting upgrade. Are you going to do the thing? Well, you're going now. Oh, it's taking it now. Okay, I don't know what the hell happened there, but it was not at one point. So we'll do that. This now we have now we're prepared for a power cable, but for now, or a power cube here. But for now, I'm just going to do it like this. Uh, do that. I think I only need one, uh, and I should just be able to put it on top right here and should fall over did it fall behind as well okay it did perfect and it didn't fall forward that is nice how much are you producing you are producing 20 fe per tick okay that is fine 20 fe that is okay. These need their upgrades again. So you upgrade. You don't need one because this thing can't even produce that much. So just leave you be. What do you have on you, bud? A rose, brown dye, nothing that I need. Okay. Okay. Oh, shit. So this does burn. Okay, that's that would make sense. Can I do this? Hopefully that will help. I wish you could place like a facade on the pipes, but I don't think you can. I hope that'll stop it from catching on fire with the glass being there to block it, but we will see. I don't know if they turn into ash. I hope they don't, because that's a lot of redstone that we would lose, but uh, yeah, okay, let's leave that there. Now, let's go ahead and collect our quest rewards. Okay, we got four gold, very nice. I thought it was just one. Let's go back into basic power here. We'll go ahead and make a mechanism energy cube, a basic one. Okay, we need energy tablets, which need infused alloy. So that's four infused alloy that we need. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Those will cook up. And then we need four more steel ingots. There is our alloy. Let's see what we get for free before we continue. Oh, redstone. Nice, okay. Now we need to create these, which require gold. Well, we used the free gold that we had. That was cool. And take two more. Collect our rewards just in case. Okay, they gave us osmium. Now we'll make another energy tablet. 
and basic energy cube yeah okay i hope these i hope these uh pipes work get away from me get out of my way okay this is going to start absorbing power and we'll have it actually clear the face and we will out Output, output, input. There we go. Okay, so this is going to start storing power. So it's just going to burn everything that this is producing um, and take that. You are empty. Oh, yeah, you're just getting. It's just taking. What the hell? Oh, that's. Oh, the J, F, E. There we go, F, E. Now this is taking all of that juicy power. All right. Oh, we got a free steel casing. Nice. That is really nice, actually. So, we can go ahead and step into maybe the energized smelter here. Do I want to do that? What does this give us again? Ah, that's right. This creates biofuel. But then we need a electrolytic separator anyway. So we might as well go ahead and craft that. What does this need? Dust, 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 dust. Iron and gold dust. Don't have any iron on me. Or sorry, gold. Make a dust. Make another dust. And then it needs two osmium dust. Okay. We need five infused alloy from that one. Five, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. And then we need two more. One, two, one, two. Okay. Ah, since this is outputting now, we need to uh, drop these upgrades on it. There we go. Now it's outputting. Yeah, it was not doing that. How much are you using right now? Like 200? Oh, only 20. Oh, so even the heat the heat generator can keep up with you. So that's good. This can keep up with the metallurgic infuser. That's good. That's awesome. Let's grab that. Let's go ahead and make this uh, electrolytic core. Now we'll grab this. And we will craft the electrolytic separator. Beautiful. Okay. So, we reorganized all of our chests in here. We set all of this stuff up. We went to do a bit of mining, and we got unlucky again with just the cave, so we just couldn't go straight down to bedrock and get to work. That's, a, that's okay, though. It pushed me to take care of a few things that I've been putting off doing, like organizing the chests. Um... And then we were able to get enough resources to extend this area out and build a few machines. And we have basic power going. It was really, really nice that we found that redstone vein that was super huge for us. That really kick-started our early power right now. So it's really cool. I'm really, I'm really happy with uh, what we've been doing so far. And we're just getting into machinery, so I am super excited about that. I always love getting to the machines. That is one of the things that I love most about Minecraft is setting up automation, factories, you know, crafting chains, etc. So we're getting into my favorite part of mod packs. I want to thank you again for watching this video. I really do appreciate it. And remember, if you have any feedback, comments, or anything, feel free to leave them below and I will always take those into account. I look forward to continuing this playthrough. I hope you all stay safe. Have a good day, and I'll see you next time. Later.